I opened my email this morning, jaw drops, not right. only Schneiderman resigning, but the circumstances truly staggering. The circumstances were pretty amazing. The speed with which it happened also, I think, caught a lot of people by surprise. We were talking about it in the newsroom this morning, less than four hours from yeah. the initial report to the resignation. And during that period, Governor uh, Andrew Cuomo oh, yeah. uh, was among the first to to call for and to give credit where it's due. It was a New Yorker report. That's New Yorker right. came out reported some women in That's some right. romantic relationships, which were abusive. But the important thing here is Schneider was really important to Wall Street. Extremely important. And I mean, the Democratic Party. And but, the Democratic Party, yeah. absolutely right. And before we get to the Democratic Party, just talk about Wall Street for one second. I mean, this is arguably, it, you remember Elliot Spitzer had Very this well. role, mm -hmm. the self-proclaimed sheriff of Wall Street. Uh, we remember also what happened to him in terms of his own um, foibles, shall we say. But the reason this is important is because if you look at what Schneiderman has done over the past few years, he got a settlement from UBS around mortgage-backed securities. He was the principal around all of the FX settlements. This is someone who really is looking after, looking for uh, bad behavior on Wall Street. So it will be very interesting to see who gets into that seat temporarily. Well, that's um, the a legislature. There's a woman who's a solicitor general right. who stepped in and she's for the time being. Right. Is, is the, legisl the, the state legislature has the ability to appoint someone and then I believe there's an election uh, in the fall. And as you said, as you mentioned, Alex, yeah. w within the Democratic Party, he's also been a huge foil for the current president Pretty of the United States. Pretty soon all the anchors yeah, are going to be women and all the CEOs are going to be women. <laughs> and gonna we'll be all be better off. Yeah. We'll be better off for it. Okay.